Hey there guys, I'm Zach and this is Zach's Editing and today I'm going to be showing you how you can turn a photo like this into something like this or this or this or this or this It's pretty much just changing the colour of a shirt or I mean um, this could be used in any other sort of colour changing that you desire So let's get into it We'll just start by opening up our image and in this case I've got it right here so we'll just delete those files. Um, so you've got this and it says a background layer. What you want to do is just grab the quick selection tool, so here we have it. Um, and then we're just going to be drawing and then selecting whatever colour slash part we want to change. Um, so I mean you could go in and um, go straight into all these details with the refine edge tool. Um, but for this, I won't be doing that because it's not necessary. But I mean, on your one, you can go into all of that detail just to make sure it's perfect because the more time you spend on it, the better it's going to look. Yeah, okay, whatever. Um, so just make sure there's no other parts that shouldn't be there. And then what we're just going to do is go down to this little adjustments um, tab. We'll click it and then we'll go up to solid color. So now with this solar color, what we can do is choose a color. Um, so we, we might put it into what color? Maybe like a light blue. Um, so what you want to do is, I'll, I'll just set that for now and then I'll show you what can happen. And then once you've got this color fill, um, you're going to put the blending mode to color. And then that's going to happen. So if you just need to change your color, it's really good because you can just double click here and then you can choose your new color and see it um, be updated. Um, so you could like put it to a nice gray or something. But what I will tell you right now is um, when you're changing it, like say if you go all the way to the top right, it's going to make it quite odd. So you always want to go down a bit and so these shirts won't be able to be as vibrant because... um. Shirts generally aren't that vibrant, but I mean like that's as vibrant as shirts would get and so that is fine. So just like put it in down from where, what colour you want. So say you want it this colour, you'll put it sort of like that, I guess. Um, so as you can see, you can't actually turn it into black. So now I'm going to show you how you can put your, um, your shirt and make it black. Okay, so pretty much if you want to turn the um, shirt black, um, so we'll just delete this, uh, we'll just hide it for now I guess. Um, you just grab the background, just hit Control J to duplicate it and then we'll just hide it. And then you want to go to, Im uh, with it selected, go to Image, Adjustments and then Replace Color. And then you'll get this little window open. Um, and then you'll get these sort of two colors. So you want to um, grab this plus and then start just clicking on different places. And then you want to set the result to black. And then you're going to bring the saturation to negative 100 and the lightness to as close to 100 as you can that still makes it look realistic. Um, so then you can see here if it's on selection, um, you can see what parts are select and what aren't. So find fuzziness 30 works pretty well and then you can go on this minus. And just click on these parts around his head that you don't want. Um, so you can just see those we don't want and then um, we'll just select these little bits again. So yeah, it's pretty much just um, getting as good as you can and then if you press OK and then say if you want to go down here and just change that little bit then you can have that selected again. Image, um, adjustments, replace color and then just choose these little bits again. And you can select those choose black, make sure those little bits aren't selected and then you can just keep going through um, these little colors to make it as good as you can. If that's not working, like for this instance it's not working for me, um, just get a simple pen, just hold alt just to eye drop and just select one of these colors and then you just want to make sure it's got a good size um, if you hold Control alt and then drag with your right mouse, then you can also change the diameter and hardness there. So just change that. And then you can just go around simply like that, just choosing the colors as you're going around. And then that will just fix up those little bits and make it look, look more realistic. 
So thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and you're able to make your own um, color changing shirts. So just remember um, you can use image um, adjustments, replace color if you want to make it black or like a dark um, color. Um, and that'll get that sort of thing and then you can patch it up with your brush or you can use a color fill so that's just on here selecting the bits that you want and then going down to adjustments and solid color and then using this color fill and then changing whatever color you want um, to make that color um, so thanks for watching um, and I'll see you in the next one